the the fire to huge to just huge temperatures. Okay, so I'm still not full health. Okay, I'm, but I'm slowly recovering. I'm doing much better. Okay, and where I am now? Okay, I'm right here. Right. I see, I see. So I kind of need to go down. I want to go kind of down. Now let me think. So, so there is that thing. There is that thing. I can explore there. Uh, there. I think if I descend and I exit not in the last cave. If I descend on the other end of this cave. I will reach the, the valley river. Uh... Or Hush River, yeah, it's it's called Hush River, and I figured out that there is no actual way to get up here through that river. You need to take this this cave, and it's the same thing with the other area as well, uh, with the middle exit. So I could jump down right now in here, but what I will actually end up doing is exploring that area right there. I feel like I have a good chance of finding there something good. Now I will sprint. Uh, sprinting isn't that much of a problem right now, but heat is. Because I'm trying to preserve my matches. That's why I will sprint. And I have the bed. Well, of course, I'm trying to pre preserve it. But still, 60% for it. Um, it's just going to be enough. I can use it almost as much as I want. I, I might not actually even need to fix it. But yeah, that's that. And I think I never went in here. I went here, I, I was lost here during one of my runs, like first run or something like that, or second, I can't remember, maybe the first one, and I never really found here anything good, but I saw that there was a moose somewhere next to this area, so you need to watch out, but overall, it's still area which I haven't discovered uh, throughout this, this run, so it's kinda good. Okay, so there is this. Can I climb up if I jump down here? No, that's the real question. I don't really see a way to get up here if I jump down. Can I do that? Mm. Yeah, well, I don't see a way to get up here. Oh, yeah, there we go. You cannot go up here. Never mind then. Oh, it's freaking cold as hell. Why is it so cold? So I'm mainly looking for some cattails. Why the hell it's so cold? Wow, the cold. What's the wind temperature? Wind chill is minus 8. Can I get a wind block? No. From where the wind is coming then? No cattails as well? Really? Come on. Now I came this far, I'll finish exploring this area. Oh wow, there is the... There are some cattails now. And is this a way down? Yes, it is. To escape this cold. Hmm, there is this climb. Of course, I'm not going to really take it right now. I'm just going to do this. But there is a way down this thing. These small waterfalls. Huh, I wonder what's here then. Is this going to be some sort of a lake or what? Or maybe some cave connection again? Hmm, that's interesting. Where does this connect? And there's another climbing area. Okay, there comes hypothermia risk. No! Don't freaking climb there. Come on. I wanted to pick up those uh, rose hips. But now just forget about those. Oh, so it's a blocked off area, I see. So you can just basically make here a shortcut from second floor to third floor. But I can reach this area on the right, this one, easily through that cave. So there is really no need for me to walk here. Uh, okay, now I'm getting this. I'm glad that I took my time and explored this area right here. I think what I'm just going to do is go back to that cave. Or maybe I should make a fire. No, I'll just head back to that same cave. And... No, just don't climb down. I'll get back to that cave. And then I'll just warm up. That's what I'll do. Because I'm taking some damage in here. Okay. Please don't freaking climb this. Harvest rose hips. Yes. That's what I wanted to do. 
Now climb up here. Okay, so basically I just need to go a lot straight and then turn left. I will lose like, I don't know, 20% of condition almost. Well, a bit less than that, to be honest. But yeah, that's my plan. But now we know if you basically use a hatchet and you break down through here. Now we know there is an actual way in here. You can actually just create a shortcut if you have an X. And you won't have to go through those caves. But then again, do you really even need to do that? Caves are actually fine. Because from this cave uh, to this cave, which is up here, you don't even need to go through waterfall. Yeah. Oh, actually, no. This is a different area. This allows you to walk towards that third, actually. Towards the other cave system. Okay, so you would enter that and then it exits on different side. Okay, yeah, yeah, now I get it. Okay, so two paths in here. I do want to go into that cave and just warm up. Maybe I could even restore some health by sleeping. So yeah, now the sprinting helps a lot. But yeah, basically we went here. So explore the whole area on the right in there. Now we could go up there and explore all the other areas. But of course, I don't really feel like making fire. I want to just preserve my matches. If the weather, if it turns out that the weather is not good, in that case, I'll just freaking, uh, I'll just freaking stay inside of that cave. I don't really care, to be honest. Oh, ptarmigans, no, don't run away from me. That's good, ptarmigans are good. Uh, can you please come closer to me? Okay, that's good thing. We have here a ptarmigan spawn, ptarmigan area. Okay, there we go. We do need a rock or two. Let's just pick up two rocks from here. Nice. So we can hire a ptarmigan while we are in that cave. But yeah, ptarmigan area, ptarmigan spawn, that's good. So right in front of this cave, exit, there is ptarmigan spot. Good to know. Okay, we'll have some health. I put Hermia raised a bit. And I can just simply go ahead and harvest this. I could, I would do that with just my bare hands. But I won't do it. Now there is another thing. I could harvest it in kilograms. Or I could harvest it in 500 grams. Each piece. And basically harvesting it in 500 grams each. Is basically more beneficial. Because you will raise your cooking skill. Because you will cook three pieces instead of two, in this case. And let's do the last one. Also, you increase carcass harvesting level. Which is useful as well. Nice. And I won't take feathers. I would have to get... Um, I'll just drop the meat in here. Won't even cook it for now. Uh, so I do want to... Now, what was I saying? Uh, oh yeah, I won't harvest ptarmigan because I need four cloth to make insulation and I really don't need uh, their their things, not even for a... Could I actually do that for a bedroll then? Wait a second. Let's see, what about bedroll? Uh, could I make my bedroll warmer? Let's see here. Uh, yeah, improvised. Where? I saw it somewhere. Improvised. Okay. Oh yeah, you do need three cloths, so we don't have that. So no luck there. Hypothermia is almost gone. So at this point I could sleep. Or I could just pass some time. I think I have enough percentage on my bedroll. I can just simply pass some time and then sleep. I'll just recover some health and stuff. Can I just add a bedroll, place it somewhere? Come on. There we go. So let's just sleep here. Maybe sleeping for like a few hours will get my heat high enough. And let's just hope that the weather stays good. There we go, our heat is up. Now how much are we carrying? Uh, not too much, it's not too bad to be honest. We could maybe go ahead and drop some, some of these things, because 
I'm gonna need to I'll just soon. probably remember the map myself. Now, we don't really need that many beard lichens, so I'll just drop a few of those. And yeah, let's see. I'm going to need to eat, but this is fine. Actually, I'll just stay a little bit uh, dehydrated, kinda. Without... I'll keep some, some drinking abilities, I guess. Okay, if I can get wind block, it's really good. If not, then whatever. So the wind is coming kind of towards this way, from the front, kind of. So yeah, if I can, I'll get all the wind block I can. All the wind block. There we go. We don't have wind block right now. I do want to run a bit here. I should get a wind block. Why am I not getting a wind block? Is it from the back then? Isn't? Is it from the back then? Damn it. So hungry. Where the hell is the freaking wind block? So I will just walk through here. It's the same basic with that. Uh, and let's just see here, look for cattails, yeah, I do see some cattails right in here. So let me just get those quickly. I will take some tinder from those. It's just really good because we can use tinder from those and I, I think they are a bit lighter than cracked the tinder from sticks. So that's why I just tend to use cattails uh, heads. Also, I mean it's free, it doesn't cost a stick and time to harvest them. Uh, yeah, it takes time to ha to make uh, to make tinder from sticks. Okay, so I'm getting cold. You can't do a lot, to be honest, in these conditions. So, from where the wind is blowing them? Where the hell is the wind block? Is it here? Where the hell is it? How did I get wind block? Okay, so I can go up here as 